Hello, internet friends. I'm Inu. And someone approached me and said, Hey, you wanna play my game? And I was like, Oh, yeah. So here is Machine Made Rebirth. And let's begin. This world was not supposed to fail. Oh, it's so cute. This world was not supposed to be ruined. Evil was not supposed to rule here. Our plight came about slowly and without reason, without explanation. If I had known then what I know now, if I had known the truth, would anything have changed? Project Fidra. Now this is a cool machine. All the art artworks are really neat in this game. I really like it. Let me start at the beginning. Many years ago, a machine was created. It was supposed to bring peace and prosperity to the world. The artwork is on point. Instead, the world was nearly torn apart during the cataclysmic Seferin War. I tried the game to see if there was any problem, so... I, I went up to the first episode, I think. It was the warlike mind of the machine which precipitated these events, a machine named Phydra. I have no idea if I pronounce it anything right, but eh. A few Zephyrin mounted a counterattack. A few Zephyrin mounted a counterattack. I don't know if I said that right. I don't think I did. Oh. The time had come for someone to take a strand, to take a stand against our all-powerful enemy. Did it. Phaedra, show yourself! You have betrayed the suffering people and for that you will pay dearly! My child, how short sight of you! You could have had paradise and instead you should die! Enough talk! Face me! Huff, huff. Enough of this! Set the suffering people free! Come closer, my child. The Seferim Once worshipped for their achievement of the highest virtues of success and efficiency. They are all dormant now. They have all failed to do what you have attempted to do. You among all of your race will defy me, the one that you have created and adored. You are the future, Titania. You are the destined one. Let's find out if you can destroy me. First battle is always meaningless. <laughs> it's like, you can't defeat the main character, evil Impossible! How could the Zephyrim have hidden you from me? There, at the moment, began a dream. There was a long dream, a dream full of darkness, in which the voice of that terrible beast haunted countless nightmares. The strangest thing, eventually, all trace of what had happened had been erased, and no one in the world would remember the truth of these events. The malevolent machine lived on, but so did you. Yeah! Save! Yeah! I can't move! Oh! Prologue! Fidra fled to the skies. There was a time of peace. 
but he and his followers were soon to return, bringing chaos and despair. The systematic enslavement of the suffering people had slowed down, but the evil machine lived on. Wake up, Titania. Wake up. Also, this is super cute. And I'm super cute. W what's happening? Where, where am I? You should be feeling better now. Your vision will return in a moment. But I could see her. What the heck? Some of your memories may return over the next few days. Unfortunately, your optical abilities may never fully recover. Optical? My eyes? You are going to be exiled from the ship. The life you lived here will become irrelevant afterwards. What you do from now on is entirely up to you. It will be best not to think about yourself or the past. But I wanna know my past. That's what makes me me. If you have any questions, now will be the time to ask them. If you do not wish to hear any more, then please gather all your belongings and meet Commander Sarah in the main hall. Eh, eh. Rest, no! Beep beep. No. I love the fact that I can run places. What else can I help you with? Information! What would you like to know? Who am I? In this city, you are known by the nickname TV. You are a member of the Sephirim race. Your name, according to our records, is Titania. Your family name is not important. They request that contact with you be discontinued. You have been disowned and you have become an exile. Sky City is no longer your home. Yeah, such such happy. What do you like to know? Where are we? We are in the infirmary of the Sky City. This city is ruled by an omnipotent machine called Phaedra. This machine looks after the inhabitants of the city, the Sephirim. Information! What would you like to know? What happened to me? You have violated Sephirim law, causing the death of one of your kin. Phaedra has had your memories erased. Fedra says you are to be exiled. Okay, that's all the information we can gather from her. Talk! Um, excuse me, do you have a minute to talk? You're finally up, TV. Seems something was traveling your sleep. I'm Dr. Ina, how may I help you? Ina. Can you tell me about yourself? I'm Ina, the ship's doctor. I've been treating you for most of the time that you've been recovering. I'm here to help you out if you need to know anything about your recovery. Memories. I can't remember anything that happened before waking up in this room, doctor. Should I be concerned? Yes. Losing some of your memories after waking up is normal. You likely went through something traumatic. To treat you, I'd have to be aware of more of your symptoms. I might be able to help you recover your memories if I could get to know you a little bit better. The ship. This is Sky City, home of the suffering people. That doesn't help me at all. The hologram. These medical holograms are very advanced technology created by Phaedra. They will tend to your injuries. Uh, nothing I guess. This desk is sacked with notes and notices. Inspect. Found city blah blah update. This desk is sacked with notes and notices. Read notes. Note for Ina. All medical files to be transferred to the data center until further notice. Okay. Uh. 
Search the dryer. Cerebral. Upgrade. What's this? This orb harms with a lifelike energy. I don't think there's anything else in this room. Dot, dot, dot. This ship is massive. How will I ever find my way around? I hope I find this Commander Sarah quickly. Look around. Oh, uh, nothing much here. Wait, who's there? <gasps> oh, it's just a droid. Nothing to worry about, of course. I was just startled. Still, it's so dark in here, so eerie. I better get out of here. Also, that's... That's armed. That, that seems to belong in war. How strange. I can't remember a thing about this ship. It's a little disturbing. Nonetheless, I have to keep moving. Absolutely. Search. Search. Nothing. Sup. Sup. Hey. Sup. Hey. Hey. Oh. Chest. Cerebral module. What is this? Blank computer and screen. Inspect. Jobs. Nothing. Hey. Hello. Are you Commander Sarah? Yes. What is it, sister? Are you looking to get started with combat training? Training? I'm I'm concerned about my training. You are going through rehabilitation. Don't worry, the Sephirim are very forgiving to criminals. Part of the rehabilitation program even includes passing combat training. I'll make this brief. Go to the training room directly below the main hall. You will receive survival tools as well as a refresher course on basic combat before you are sent into exile. The service droid in the training room has your training pass. The training pass will allow you to access the training program using the computers in the training room. Training room? Where would I find the training room? It just told me. <laughs> but uh, uh, It's through the doors in the other end of this hall. Once you're done there, come back and see me. Why do they call me sister? I'm not your sister. Commander? Would it be possible to get some help with combat training? You'll be on your own for most of your training, however. If you need information, don't hesitate to ask. Okay or not okay, that's not okay, but okay. I'll do my best. Just make your way. After that, you'll be ready for the next stage of your rehabilitation. I still have questions. I have lots and lots of questions. Where are my things? Do I have any personal belongings on board? Where would I be able to find those? Yes, the hologram told me that I should gather my stuff. Everything that you will need should be located in the training room. Regarding your belongings, you'll have access to the storage room and lockers from now until you leave. Is that clear? But, so everything I get to take with me fits into a storage locker? It's exile, Sister Sephirim, not a vacation. Oh, okay. So, this is where I'm supposed to come? Hey, hello. This is the training room. How may I help you? Information. What do you wish to know? Keycard. To participate in combat training, you must have a training keycard. Do you have a training keycard? Yes. Access combat training. Oh, I forgot the point. Access combat training from the computer at the other end of the hall. You'll find your equipment for basic training in the equipment lockers against the wall. Don't forget to equip them. Okay, let me steal all your goodies. Storage room key! Oh wow! Alright. Here at the equipment lockers where you find your training equipment. You'll be allowed to carry real weapon if you cooperate with a prestigious of basic training. So I need to talk to that. Inspect. 
This computer terminal has various instructions for basic survival skills and combat intent to read by trainees. I never read those. Like, I never read it before. Let's inspect the glowing computer terminal. This computer terminal activates combat traits for a trainee's combat training. There is a keycard that someone left, partially inserted into the card slot. Take the card. Beep beep. The maintenance Roy gave you a trainee keycard. No. Last time, I didn't went straight to do the training. I just said, hey, here is another door. Where could that possibly leave me? This hallway spits in two directions. You can go left or you can go right. You can go left or you can go right. You can go beep, beep, beep. There. Oh, hi! The maintenance ro gave you 200 credits. It's like a lot of money. It's a lot of money. Found blueberries. This drawer is password protected. Oh gosh, incorrect. Oh, of course. The storage key. Cerebral upgrade. What? Cut on dress. Lock it. I don't remember where. Let's go left. Sup. Go ahead, sister. Just ahead is Fidra Central Processing Unit. Before teleportation, it is imperative that you check the matter evening drive inside the planetarium. What? Speak with Commander Starup first. Once you finish basic combat training, you can access the planetarium through these doors. The computer panel beside the door should scan your keycard. That will allow you to get to the planetarium. Let me talk to you. Oh shit, shut the head of central processing unit before teleportation. Yes, a uh, matter evening drive. Speak with Commander Stara. She'll help you get through basic combat training. You'll receive a silver keycard. Silver keycard will be vital to the second stage of your training. Through the red door right in front of us is a, a flight of stairs. You'll find a planetarium and a matter evening drive. So, I need to go training and then I need to come here. And then I need to come here. Welcome to Fidra's Cortex. What do you require? What would you like to know? What's this place? Cortex, where Fidra's main processing unit is stored. Ah, stored. It is also the only place where a technological entity or Sephirim can interface with Fidra's personality. For most Sephirim, it's a holy site. Now, this will ask me some questions and I need to answer them correctly oh shoot these bulkheads are surrounded by screens with flashing data tables and Zephyrin script there is a pound shaped button in the middle it appears to be a direct access port to the personality of Fidra the central hub for Zephyrin computers blackberries so this thing ask me questions and because I'm silly, you know how silly I am, I did the training and I didn't came here. I came here. I guessed all the questions and I was gone. <laughs> I was like, I don't need half the stuff I was supposed to do. What the heck? This is locked. A blank computer. Inspect this computer access information about Memoria. Turn on! Read about Memoria! Memoria are crystals containing the per preserved memories of those who lived during the Zephyrim War. They can grant information about the history of the Zephyrim as well as bestow special abilities to the user. Look out for Memoria on your adventure! Talk to me! Beep! Oh! Oh, it gave me a cardiovascular module. How nice. Search. Empty. 
What is this? Move it. What is this? Suck. Let's move it. Crack. Something was unlocked. I bet it was this. Found a cookie. It's probably going bad. Search the drawer. Found a lot of credits. This guy is a dick. <laughs> what you did was really wrong. You should try to behave better when you reach Mika's Iceland. Talk with an exile? Really? Leave me alone. You and I have no connection to each other anymore. Hi. Um, excuse me. I was wondering if you could help me find my way around. Tybee, I... I can't talk. Why can't you talk? This, this, I think this is the person we saw at the beginning, like, running away from us. Who are you? I'm a friend of yours, in fact. I wish I could say more, but I, I will have to wait. Search! Found a slip of paper! Right then, Anis, it's... 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 1. Uh, maybe that's a password. What required that password? I can't remember what the password Because I didn't do it before Sup, Doctor? Hello, Doctorina What's on your mind, TV? Cookies I was wondering if there's a bakery on board Can you tell me anything about these cookies? Is that... One of the ship's cookies? Do you mind if I have it? I adore them and rarely have time to get them for myself. Sure. Of course, Doctor. Last cookie. No, my cookie. Thank you. Those are delicious, by the way. May I ask you how you've been feeling since you woke up? I... I, I yeah, not right. Haven't been feeling that great. What's wrong, TV? Exile? I'm worried about my exile. It's not easy facing up to exile, however. Fear is of neighboring people and should be obeyed. Okay. What's on my mind? Oh no! Oh shoot, did I? Last time I. I told her I wasn't sure about my memories. Oh no. Oh no. What's that? Oh no. Ah. Oh. oh shoot. Oh fuck. Is there another cookie I can get? Can I get another cookie? Because it was kind of a side quest last time. Oh no. Ah, oh, I've done goofed. Oh well, I didn't even do it last time. Training. Oh dear. Yes, the training card. Don't forget to read the equipment and prepare items before combat. Oh shoot. Now, let's back.